Hi there guys and welcome to another Train Sim 2018 video. This one's a bit of a different video as well than what I usually do. This was a request by uh, actually somebody I know um, and it was their birthday uh, on Friday and this video should have been out on Friday but it hasn't been um, and they are getting an EPB for their birthday anyway and I said I will get a video of a quick look around the EPB up for Friday and unfortunately due to some technical errors I wasn't able to do it. So here you go mate, here is the EPB. So cab wise it looks like a southern region EMU I um, mean there's nothing massively different about it than anything else. Chris Horsfield's done some wonderful texture upgrades and everything like that on it. Uh, one thing I know you will want to hear is this. And then from inside the cab. Does it have a passenger view? Yeah, we do. We have a passenger view. This is actually a scenario that comes with the North London line. Um, it's meant to have the Steam 313 in it, but I've got the Armstrong Powerhouse one, not the Steam one. So it's got those missing. What we're going to do is we're going to open our doors, we're going to take on some passengers. And then we're just going to take a quick run, probably down to South Acton. Oh no, it'll be nice. We've got Acton Central. We'll go Acton Central. Just because I've not really driven the, the EPB much. What have we got? We do have instrument lights. We've got headlights. We have cab lights. It's just not the worst model in the world at all, really, is it? Of opening windows, no. There's a four sig or a vep heading off that way. I can never tell the difference. All these silly names for southern region stuff. <laughs> it's not that silly. I only think it's silly because I don't know them all. What's vep? Vestibule? Electro? Pneumatic? Uh, this is a. EPB, which is electro pneumatic brake. There's BEP, which is buffet electro. There's also there's a LAV one, isn't there? Which just means it has a toilet. And there's uh, REP, which is restaurant EP brake. There's um, I think it was restaurant or EP brake. And there's VEG. All sorts of strange ones. But it looks quite good. Uh, I think I know the one the lad's getting is Kent Link one, but I couldn't get that one up for this scenario. This is the slightly weathered BR Blue variant. Mad ferret pet supplies. I used to have ferrets. Loved them. We are rail fans. I do prefer the term rail fan than train spire. Because uh, I'm not a spire, but I like trains. And I'm a fan of trains. So I suppose that does make me a rail fan, doesn't it? Every time I hear train spire, I think people that are going on the platform just to get numbers. It's got the shunt series parallel weak field. There is a backdated train sim version of the North London lines, uh, which I did have installed, but for some reason since the reinstall I don't, so I'm going to have to put that back on. And that is real EPB territory, that is. Q. 
few gardens in one mile. So it's, a, it's quite nicely modelled in train sim and the Backman version of this is, is a very pretty model, very very pretty double O gauge model. Gardens it is. Let's have another little look outside for you. I actually drove this on the South Network, South London Network on a stream the other week and the doors opened on the other side. Which was uh, interesting to say the least. God, station wait times on this are pretty lengthy. No gangways on the EPBs either. And whatever that is for a coupling. Never really thought what was in between them, to be fair. <laughs> Looks like something from London Underground, like a single buffer and all the jumper cables are way high level. It does look quite good. Do you know, tell a lie, I think it might have been this route that I did the scenario on the stream and it went a bit wrong.
There we go, Gunnersbury. Poking his head out there, look. Oh, it's lighting up the underbridge. It's a really weird detail, actually, that the the way these uh, multiple work, the jumper cables go between is quite nice. <coughs> and the steps that are down in between look nice quality. It's actually a really nice bit of kit. Also, just realised that the the lad this is for will really enjoy this because it's got the confirmed logo on the front for him. Enjoy that. I'm pretty sure the EPBs didn't have toilets either, did they? Or did one? No, I don't think they did. In this day and age, they used to have uh, like rounded things that, when you twist them, one side said free and one said in use. And if you put it in the middle, it'd say freeze. How long are we meant to be at South Acton for? Oh no, a couple more seconds, that's not too bad. It's also about state as the art is washing up liquid really, isn't it? The EPB. Oh, I like the BR arrows on the driver's top. It's quite nice that. And the streaking effect on the textures is, is nice as well. I don't know if that's done as a. Uh, I'll get shot by Albie if I don't say this right. Is it an alpha layer? And Chris, he'll shoot me for it as well. That you do the, the weathering on. I can never remember, or the Alpha Channel.
trees in North London. I suppose people could have them in their back garden, couldn't they? Alright then guys, I'm going to leave this video here. Once again, thanks very much for watching. Uh, please feel free to like, share and subscribe to this video. And to whose birthday this was made for, happy birthday. Hope you've had a good day. Hope you're sticking to your tasks and doing what you need to be doing over the weekend. And I will see you soon.